I think Brian Clough was arguably the greatest manager the country has ever produced. Mm. Do you think Brian Clough, given the nature of the way the game's changed mm. and the way that the players have changed yeah. and the empowerment of players, do you think he can still manage in this day and age? Absolutely. Fantastic. Great. Absolutely. Most people think he couldn't. Well, I know, but most people don't know him. He would have been able to would have he done been it. Able to doubt? Well, yeah, your your question is almost saying, uh, would George Best have been a player now? No, no, George, no, no. I think George, <laughs> I think George Best is the greatest player ever. Well, there you are. Well, George Best, with all the enhancements have been made, George Best would have scored another two hundred goals. I agree. Absolutely. I agree. And and you're not saying but, but that a you're not two just a minute. Things, just let, let me get this point. Brian Clough was a really intelligent man. Agreed. A really intelligent man. Really intelligent. Smart. With it. Knew about players, knew about people, knew about knew about all the changes. Did he did he reel against the changes that were starting to take place in the game? Yes, of course he did. But he was clever enough to know on how he could deal how he could deal with those. That's the point. Brian Clough would have been a massive success now. He would have been a mass, and he would have been every bit as as well, good, to good to listen to, to as ever. That's Serious, good to hear. and I'm not just saying that. I, I'm I'm not an apologist for him. No, I'm just no. telling you that he would have been a success. And and I I will go to turn around and tell you that Bill Shankly, the orator, the Bill Shankly was, mm -hmm. would have been a success. It absolutely, because they would deal success. with the situation. They would have been able to deal with the situations. And right? Adapt. Would would adapt? Yeah, absolutely.